I'm going to take my talents to South Beach and um, join the Miami Heat. I mean, it feels like yesterday, but that was four years ago. But this time around, LeBron chose a little different way to announce his next move. An article in Sports Illustrated. There was also a big difference in how the city of Cleveland responded. They went from burning jerseys to screaming and yelling and celebrating outside the star's home. It might seem crazy, but if you're from Cleveland, it apparently makes total sense. They were able to bury that hatchet pretty easily. Here to explain, uh, two natives, our producer Kelly Bowman and Bob Bob Kosick, he's actually a fiance of one of our producers, Mackenzie, so you're an honorary producer. Here's something that you may not know about HLN. There are a ton of people from Ohio. I'm from Ohio, Robin's from Ohio, our whole makeup room's from Ohio, so this is close to our hearts. Now, you guys, I remember walking into the newsroom and looking at you and being like, Kelly, what do you think? And you're like, yeah! So what was your reaction when you heard the news? Oh, my gosh. I was so excited. I mean, I literally heard it walking through the newsroom. I was with our intern, Allison, and someone was like, ESPN says it's confirmed. I was like, no, it's, oh my gosh, ah, you know, it was just, and everyone looked at me like I was a crazy person, which I think most people think of Ohio. Well, because, about now. no, <laughs> no. Well, Ohio sports fans are loyal, but that's why I say there were no grudges. Like, no one said, come on, you burned us four years ago. You know what? I didn't wear this shirt for two years because it's the same shirt LeBron wore <laughs> on the night of the original decision. Seriously? So it is coming out of the closet. I am excited. I am happy. I am so glad LeBron is back. Cleveland deserves it. We have the Holy Trinity with, with LeBron. LeBroni basketball, Johnny football, and now the RNC. Exactly. Uh, I'm so happy. It's been a good few weeks for Cleveland, that's for sure. What do you think? Predictions? Championship? You know, I don't know. I mean, I think it's too soon to tell, but I think if, you know, if anybody knows anything about Clevelanders, it's that we're resilient and, you know, we're going to stand by our team no matter what. So LeBron has the best support system you could possibly have. We're this, excited. You no, know, you guys know Cavs sports better than I do. Is this going to be a huge turnaround for them? I mean, are you going to see a totally different team? Oh, yeah, definitely. It's not, we had 26 game losing streak a few years ago. So, I, so I'm expecting, need it. yeah, I'm expecting playoffs, not one. Not two, not three, as LeBron would say. I, I'm keeping my schedule Seven. clear. Seven. Yeah, <laughs> keeping my schedule clear for 11 months from now because we are winning the NBA champion. No doubt about that. And no most importantly, that. your gingham was able to come out of the closet and, and actually be, be worn once again. Yeah. Bob, we appreciate that. You guys, so fun. So glad that the fans in Cleveland are happy. If you're a fan in Miami, not so much. But, you know, we had to represent Ohio because it's close to our hearts. Guys, thanks for being here. Thanks for having us. <laughs> thanks.